Hey YouTube, welcome back. I am your host, Random Reactions HD, and today it's Thursday, and yeah, I'm gonna be reacting to top 10 most dangerous water slides. So yeah, should be interesting. Sit back, relax, enjoy. Grab your favorite beer, beverage, pop soda, tea, coffee. You know the drill by now, as always. Got my tea. If you're new, consider subscribing, turn on that notification bell, hit that thumbs up button, helps out the channel, lets YouTube know that you like this content, and uh, yeah, without any further do da diddly day, let's do this in 3, 2, like and subscribe, and you'll have amazing luck for the rest of the week. Water is cool. Water is life, and water is refreshing. So, water yeah. parks are places of fun, and shouldn't really scar you for life. But then again, there are some water slides out there whose stories will give you the creeps. And today, we'll rank 10 of some of the most dangerous water slides in the world. Number 10. Number 10. The Aqua Loop. The Aqua Loop. The Aqua Loop is one of those water slides where single riders stand inside an enclosed platform. From there, they're dropped near a vertical slide into an inclined loop, and it all happens within a matter of seconds. Crazy. If you're a fan of water parks, then you've probably seen one of these before, because they're all over the world. But the thing is, aqua loops have one design problem, and that's because they are so fast that riders often get stuck halfway across the loops. When that happens, you can only pray that's that bad comes before you sustain any major injury in 2016 one particular incident like that happened have you ever got stuck in a water side let me know down below in the comments been at the popular queensland theme park australia back then a teenage girl landed in the hospital wing because of a spinal injury after riding the aqua <sighs> luckily she made it out alive however because of that and many other incidents, I dare not mention that riding an aqua loop now comes with one rule. Wear your swim shorts inside out to avoid getting any zippers or cords trapped by the contours yep. of the slide. Number nine. Number nine. Insano. Insano. When it was constructed in Brazil in 1989, the Insano Brazil. was as tall as a 14-story building. Back then, Riders speed up as fast as 65 miles per hour, and it only takes five seconds for the riders to travel down the entire 14 stories. So the Guinness five World seconds. Records rated Insano as the tallest and scariest water slide in the world. Although today it has long been displaced from that position, but the mark it left on the mind of some of its riders remains. To ride the Insano, the instructors would mandate that you ride alone, on your back, with your legs and arms crossed. This is because Insano is so steep that along the line, you travel so fast that you literally start flying in the air. And here you now, go. That's what freaks people out. Because unlike other safer water slides, the sliding board in the Insano is opened. That means if you get too airborne, things You're might gone. go crazy really fast. For that reason, they expect riders on Insano to be at least four foot six. And luckily to date, no one has ever died on Insano. Well, I'm glad. Number eight. Number eight. Phaser. Phaser. Most water slides out there. You should. S yeah. Phaser. Yeah. They are safe for every adult, more or less. But as for Phaser, the authorities made it a no go area for women. And I must admit, I would say that their concerns are not misplaced. The Phaser is one out of 20 original designs of water slides at the famous Galaxy Erding Water Park in Germany. Germany. But unlike the others, the Phaser makes you slide down at a speedway higher than the normal speed limit of a car. So, that makes it one of the most intense water slides in Germany, and by extension, on the planet. Of course, such crazy slides come with danger. On Phaser, the danger is so directed at women that at some point, about six women reported hospital injuries to their genitals. Because of that, the park authorities agreed to ban women from riding Phaser. <laughs> Men, however, are not affected, 
because phaser seems to be more compatible with the male anatomy. But that doesn't mean that the male heart will beat any slower. It's just that no man has been injured on phaser. Yet. Number seven. Number seven. The black hole. The black hole. The black hole is among the 17 water slides inside the wet and wild water park found in our We have like this um, black hole in my country, um, water slide park, um, tower park, and um, yeah, there's a bit in it where it's a black hole. I'll put a link in the description below, below if it's on YouTube. Orlando in 1977. As of today, the water park is now closed. Back in its heyday, it was the one place to visit, and it enjoyed that glory for almost 40 years, all thanks to the black hole. The black hole was a twisting 500-foot slide with black-colored tubes ridden by a raft. On average, you'll need about 23 seconds to make it through the slide. 23 Three seconds, seconds in the completion, black. The operator would have sent another raft through. There was no way to be sure a raft wasn't making it through the ride before the next one was sent along its way. Although in most cases, things panned out well. But in 1944, this slide pinched the spinal cord of one man when his raft collided with another raft already stuck in the black hole. In the end, the man successfully sued for $1.73 million. And finally, the park had to close in 2016 because of other similar cases inside the black hole. Number six. Number six. The Leap of Faith. Leap of Faith. The Leap of Faith is a water slide inside the Atlantic. I've seen this one in, in the middle. There's like sharks and all that. It's Paradise Island in the Bahamas. By height, it stands up to nine stories. But by design, they made it for daredevils with a thing for sharks. Because at the end of the slide, there's a large tank filled with live Caribbean reef sharks, hammerheads, and stingrays. But before getting to that part, you as a rider would have dropped the entire nine-story slide shaped like a Mayan temple. Afterward, you would then be squeezed into underwater transparent tubes that passed right through the middle of the shark tanks. If you're afraid of heights, then the fear of that alone could give you a heart attack as you climb up the temple. But if you're finally able to let go of that fear, it would take a leap of faith before you try sliding past the sharks. I like to play it safe because one time ago, one shark died while trying to get into the slide. So who knows, another day, the sharks may decide to break the tubes. Number five. Number five. The steamer water slide. The steamer water slide. The steamer water slide is one of the wildest attractions at the Calypso Water Park in Ottawa. But according to many people who have actually been on it, they likened it to a toilet bowl because of the shape of this slide. <laughs> but the reason I considered it dangerous is far more than that. The thing is, often owners admit their slides are dangerous, so they try to hire competent workers to manage for them. In the case of the steamer water slide, the authorities continually lied about the dangers associated with their slide. They did this so that people would continue to ride on it. Whereas frequently, the steamer water slide has gained about 11 different safety tests. In fact, in 2011, there were several reports of rafts flipping inside the slide. <laughs> Sadly, two different riders broke their vertebrae and collarbones while riding the steamer slide that year. Yet every day, the park continues to reopen the slide, ignoring the dangers that lurked within. So, it's best you stay far away, because there's plenty of other slides out there. Number four. Number four. The Verrucht. The Verrucht. Germany. With a height equivalent to a 16-story building, the Verrucht was once the tallest water slide in the world. Back then in 2014, building it cost 3.6 million, and that makes it one of the most expensive water slides in the world. It was also the most popular water slide in all of Kansas City, but that glory was short-lived, and it closed down in 2016 when, of course, something terrible happened. In this video, I won't talk about all the gory scenes that happened back then, but know that the unfortunate incident involved a 10-year-old boy and two other women, and they later took the owners of the Verrucht to court. During the investigation, 
they revealed that the water slide had actually injured 13 other people, only that their cases weren't as fatal as the boys. Besides that, the investigations also revealed that the Verruckt was unsafe for use, so they finally demolished it in 2018. As for the case of the young boy, the family successfully sued the owners of the Verruckt for $20 million. Wow. Now it's time for our best pick. Best pick? Yes, most theme park rides are dangerous because, well, they're often made for daredevils. But then, this one at the top of the list today beats the others to their game. Let's find out what it is. Number three. Number three. Yost Waterworld. The Yost Waterworld. Abu Dhabi is a place of fun. Abu and Dhabi. To one of the largest water parks in the world. This water park is called Yas Waterworld. It's just minutes from Ferrari World, Warner Brothers World, and World in Abu Dhabi. Besides that, it measures up to 25 football fields and houses about 45 slides, rides, and other adrenaline attractions. 25 football fields. So now you have an idea about how big and beautiful this water park actually is. However, size is not the only thing that makes this place popular. It also features the largest man-made waves on the planet, and the water slides are open to both amateurs and pros. But frequently, these slides get stuck halfway just before the major drop. Before the raft resumes, it would need the divine intervention of the park workers. While they help, you and others would hang in the balance. This waiting is essential, and the park authorities warn the riders not to move in this kind of condition. The thing is, such warnings mean that anything can happen and they're usually one of the greatest advertisements for danger. Number two. Number two. The Cedar Point Water Park. The Cedar Point Water Park. There are many attractions of the Cedar Point Water Park in Ohio, and each one of them had inflicted at least one injury on unfortunate riders. But on the list today, I want to talk about the most expensive water ride ever built on Cedar Point, and of course, the most notorious. The name of the water slide was Shoot the Rapids, and it opened to the public on June 26, 2010. When it opened, everyone wanted to have a taste of the ride. Okay. But just three years after its debut, a terrible accident happened on July 19, 2013. On that day, a boat loaded with gas and seven riders rolled back down on Shoot the Rapids to hit a concrete edge and then another boat. As a result, the boat flipped over, leaving the riders stranded underwater. For several minutes, their heads were upside down before park employees could rescue them. Thankfully, they survived, and only one of them had to go to the hospital. After the incident, wow. the ride was closed and reopened one year later. But the bad rap lived on. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell. Already You'll done. 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number one. Number one. The Grave Pool. The Grave Pool. The Grave Pool was the nickname to the section of New Jersey's Action Park that opened to the public in 1978. If the name hasn't scared you off already, perhaps you should know that every inch of this action park drew tears, broke teeth, and took lives in his glory days. So, let me run you through the highlights. In 1984, a section of the park called Tarzan Swing triggered a lethal heart attack in one man who accidentally jumped into cold water. Soon after, another man stepped on a live wire while kayaking. Many people broke their teeth inside the crazy cannonball. Three teenagers drowned in the grave pool where 1,000 people swam at once. And within 12 months, the action park recorded 14 bone fractures and 26 head injuries. According to the report, the grave pool needed about 30 rescues per day. Yet severe injuries rolled in mass and so did the lawsuits. But somehow, the action park is still open to this day. So if you think about visiting this place, please think again. Until next time, adios. Adios. 1,000 people. That's crazy. Um, the only one I thought that was sus was... Uh, 
think it was number five. I think I'll have to re look at it again later on. Um, but yeah, all of them were pretty cool. Comment down a bit below which was your favourite one. Did you think any were like kind of sus or anything? Let me know. And yeah, until next time, this is Random Reactions signing out. Take care and bye bye.